So unfortunately, we're talking about it again. The Houston area is seeing an uptick in COVID cases this summer. The amount of virus detected in wastewater has been going up as well. We've been watching that and joining us now live is the city's chief medical officer, Dr. David Purse. Thanks for joining us here this afternoon, doctor. But let's jump right into the questions here. What exactly is causing the increase in cases? Is it because it's summertime, people are traveling, or is it that people are staying indoors because it's so hot outside? <laughs> you know, that's a, that's a great question, <clears throat> and I think we've seen over the pandemic that uh, this virus is a little bit hard to predict, and so it, we are noticing that it's come in waves, and these waves are about six months apart, and so we're a little bit late for this. We're about maybe eight months from the last uh, peak of the last wave, and we will see this with pandemics. As, as time goes on, the, the, the waves be, become less severe, and they, and they start to spread out. So I anticipate a year from now, it'll probably be a seasonal thing, but this is a, another wave that's in time with what we've seen in the past. So what are hospitalizations like at this point? Are they on the rise here locally? So they are on the rise, fortunately, uh, at a much, much lower level than what we've seen in the past. And so the amount of increased virus we're seeing in the wastewater tells us there are a lot more people in the community that are becoming sick. And, and I say a lot as a relative term compared to what we were several weeks ago, but the hospitalizations are not keeping pace with that like we had seen in the previous wave. So that's good news. And this probably because most people have some form of immunity either through vaccination, or previous illness or both so that when they get infected this time they're getting much less sick than when they got infected for the first time yeah you mentioned just now on um, previous vaccinations as we approach the fall months here in the future what can you tell us about those vaccines for the fall so we're going to wait for the cdc to come out with their final recommendations but i anticipate that they're going to recommend that we get you know another shot coming th this fall uh, this is really important for folks who've never been vaccinated. And the reason I say that is that of the people who are being hospitalized, they're predominantly elder folks, so over the age of 60 with chronic illness. And we are seeing some deaths still that are because of COVID, not just along with COVID. And those are people almost exclusively of people who had, were never vaccinated. And so the vaccine won't necessarily prevent you from catching the illness, but it does a great job of keeping you from becoming critically ill. And so this is why we would really encourage anyone who's never been vaccinated, please take advantage of the vaccine and get yourself vaccinated and protect yourself this time around. Yeah, Dr. Purse, I even thought about breaking out the masks again because it just mm -hmm. seems like so many people are catching COVID again, and it's definitely a concern. Dr. David Purse with the Houston Health Department, thank you so much for coming on Fox 26 Houston and keeping us informed. Thank you.